Deputies in Galveston County have made an arrest in connection with a double homicide in Port Bolivar, and they say the suspect is the father of one of the dead women. That's Deputies testified 46-year-old James Cosby from Houston and charged him with two counts of tampering with evidence. Cosby is the father of 24-year-old Brittany Cosby, who was found dead, along with her friend 24-year-old Crystal Jackson. Both women were from Houston. Cosby and Jackson were found behind a store in Port Bolivar on March 7th. James hey guys, this is Cassandra. Welcome back to Enchanted Bayou. But I, I found out that there was kind of a tragic story with that hotel, something more recent even. Um, back in 2013, a man got out of jail. Uh, he was in jail for um, not registering as a sex offender for some stuff that he had done prior. And when he got out of jail, he realized that, um, well, he was lit. he had to go live with his mother and he saw his, he has a daughter. His daughter is 24 years old. She was doing great. She had her own car, she had a job, she had really gotten her life together. Um, she had a partner, unfortunately to him, um, her partner was another woman and he was really upset. One, not only that his daughter was doing so well for herself when he was doing so poorly, but two, that she was gay. And so um, that's the reason they believe that he actually killed his daughter and killed her lover and drug both of the girls' bodies out right in front of that hotel, right actually where we were standing. Um, and this was just a few years ago, this was in 2014, that all of this happened. Um, so anyway, fortunately, he is in jail for everything he did, and hopefully he stays there for a long time. Um, but we do have some really good EVPs there, and I will definitely be going out there to check. Um, the EVP is just on my camera, though, so it's kind of a weird recording, but you can clearly hear a girl talking when that was not us at all. Um, so we will be going out there and doing that, so make sure you like and subscribe so I can get you that video. Talk to you guys soon. Allison, but yeah, we are gonna um, go check it out. Um, if you haven't heard a, a little video, um, we went to the we went to the lighthouse, and um, you should go check it out. Yeah, the the other video on Boulevard is gonna be amazing. It's very spooky. Yes. Okay, let's Thank go check this out. Angeles? There's Max. Where is it? Los Angeles. I don't know. Let's go. Let's go in a separate room for Max. Come on. Los Santos. Ooh, this is creepy. Wow, this is creepy. And the floors are like all moss. Whoa. I really need my light. Creepy, creepy, creepy. Wow, that's the bathroom. And the ceiling's leaking. Definitely don't want to be on the second floor. Yeah. I guess that's the sink. I don't know if you can see in this room. Oh, it's, a sink. oh, it's another room. I guess that door, the double, a door here. I don't know. It looks old though. Okay, let's go in. I'm, gonna go in this room now if you see anything spooky on this video or if you know anything about this building that would be great oh man it looks like someone's been like staying here we have got a mattress here well they're not staying here now this is all molded they've been peeing in bottles that's kind of gross We'll put those in the video. Oh my and the God. ceiling is leaking. It looks like glass here. Oh my goodness. What the heck happened to the bathroom? Oh. This is so creepy. Well, there's a window. 
Yeah, here's the window out the back. Yeah, heck yeah. Ah, very interesting view. Yeah, this is in the whole game. This, I think this is in the whole game. Oh, light fixture. Oh, cool lights. Here we go. Watch out for glass. Is there glass on the floor? Yeah, I saw this glass. Okay. Looks like someone tried to board it up. But when Hurricane Ike came through here, this whole island, when Hurricane Ike came through here, this whole island pretty much got leveled and ruined. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, scratch marks all over the walls. It does look like homeless people have been staying here. But oh, I couldn't imagine. I mean, the floor is just yeah, like so soaking wet. Look at the glass. Let's go explore. Look at the glass. Wow, this one still has a bathtub. Cool. Let's go take a bath. Oh, and a towel rack. Let's go take a bath. That just looks scary, that wallet's back there. Wow. A bunch of seashells. Oh my goodness. And some videos we don't want to know about, and someone's throwing in their trash. Look at the ceiling. Uh huh. No, it's just. We got scratch marks in a woman. Oh, that's kind of a cool picture. Nature's taking over. Just another room. Ooh, mosquitoes. Big old mosquitoes. Probably a great place for mosquitoes to be living. Yeah, blanket. Wow. Blanket. Yeah, someone was staying here. Don't think they're staying here anymore. Wow, look at that old plug. All the paint's peeling off. My goodness. Holes through the wall. That's spooky. Wonder if people were trying to crawl back in there to get get dry. Uh, don't Why? No one's in here. Don't come through here, Ellie. I heard. Oh, this place is really bad. Gosh, looks like someone just came in here with the hammer and just tore the place up. Or a sledgehammer. Had to be careful. I'm wearing really bad shoes. We were not planning to do this, but I caught myself right before those nails on those boards went into my feet. There's Allie. In front of this place is actually a convenience store. Maybe it was the original office. Here's another another hotel room. Let's see if we can sneak back here real quick. Well, I guess you can't get up to the second floor anymore. That's the way up to the second floor. I don't know if you can hear me over this. Look at the fog though. And right there's Boulevard. This is just, just a creepy hotel.
here, I'm gonna put you guys up here. Let's see if you see anything over there. Anyone in there? Well, we saw one staircase is actually torn up. Whoa, look at this door. I guess the doors were painted blue at one point in time. Oh, I'll have to look this place up. That looks... I'm glad I'm not here at night, because that would have scared me. It looks like a man pointing. I would have thought that was like some kind of shadow figure or something. That would have really been scary. Let's see. No staircase to get to the top, though. They took it all down. I wonder what happened to this place. You know, I mean, how long has it been here? I would love to see what's on the second floor. I don't see any way to get up there, though. I don't see any way to get up there. What is this? Oh, gross. Oh. oh wow, there's another building torn down back here. We're gonna go check it out, guys. Uh, too bad Max isn't around, we could scare him through the window. What is this building? We have to be careful because there is a business in front of this place. And I think they are open. Ooh. See, I want to see what's in those rooms up there. They don't look as torn up as the ones down here. If you see anything or you hear anything, uh, post it in the comments below. I would love to hear, hear about it. Oh, that's the worst thing here. That's scarier than anything here. A huge fire ant pile. Do not mess with that. What is this? Just some random building. You still see tiles. Huh. I guess the, the convenience store up front uses this to throw away some of their trash or something. Look at the roof on this thing. It's just torn down. It's going to sound crazy, but I'm still waiting for something to jump out of one of those. Like window gate things up there on the building. Okay, I'm starting to get attacked by mosquitoes. Sorry about the cut there. My camera stopped. It only record so long. I can hear the mosquitoes like buzzing now though. Ugh. Just a whole bunch of trash back here. That's it for this haunted place, I guess, over by Bolivar. I don't know if it's haunted or not. Um, but with all the hurricanes and all the history that Galveston has, that y you never know with places around here. It's just kind of creepy. So if you see anything, let me know in the comments below. But hit that like button and subscribe because we're going to be doing a lot of adventures. It's not always going to be haunted necessarily or abandoned. We're just going to go do some fun things. So join us. We would love to have you along. Take care. Bye.